waiting. I sit and I wait, alone, solitary. I wonder, I question their lateness, lateness, belated. Alone I sit, only waiting. Walking. Walking toward destination. Love walking. And we walk to accomplish. To accomplish our needs as a social atmosphere. Walking. We walk to destroy. Running. I run for I am late. My heart beats, worried. Deep. My boyfriend's so deep. He's so... very deep. Yes. continue to wait. They're not usually late. It's out of character. But I sit and I wait. But hark! Here he comes. I went to the forest to live. Only to find that I had not lived. It's good to see you. It's good to see you. Welcome, Falkor. What kept you? Whatever keeps us. <laughs> oh, so true. So true. I'm a little worried about synopsis. Tell me. Well, in sixth period today, he was writing notes. They weren't poetic at all. I did not find. For yes, time has abandoned me. And yet I bring a friend. I'm Evangelia. I'm afraid. Hi, friend. Welcome. Of course. Um, we'll have to talk in a bit. Um, has Synopsis explained to you sort of what our little group is about? I have explained the trio of knowledge, the trio of thought. Correct. She has a basis of what we as a group expect of each other, and yet she agrees with our wits. So we will find out whether or not she's worthy. I feel that she is. For one cannot judge for what one has not found. Perhaps we've found a fast friend. But if not, <laughs> One has not found. We shall. Do not be talk. speedy. Do not be speedy. Oh, Walk sometimes our... you're so thick. We are all brothers. We are. I fear we deserve the warning. The balance is frail. One can warn, but what does one listen? <sighs> okay. Okay. Um. Can we get about the business? We can get about the business. I've been thinking we need a moniker. Perhaps we are in dire need of said moniker. I was leaning toward Philosopher Kings. Very good, very good. Uh, what century? Ooh. Ooh. 18th, 17th, late, 
I was leaning Later. towards late 17. Late 17, late I understand. 17. Uh, movement. Can we get a movement established? I think the beauty is that Philo's being loved and Sophist being knowledge. No, it doesn't capture it all. For there is such a, a scope of love that is missing. You have to remember when Philos, however, became into power, Beatrice was one who did challenge his ways, and yet he did not understand his motives. And so we have to question whether or not, was it Philos or Beatrice who was worthy of one's own? Oh, um, sometimes I think you speak just to hear your own voice. Oh, you. Your tones. Evangeline, don't question me now. Your tones. Don't they question me now. But your words. Evangeline, Balkar, empty. what do you they think? They are empty as a well. With no water. Empty as a well is empty as your own head. Oh, please. Please, please yourself. Please. Please, please yourself. We are all brothers. Be back. <sighs> For I'm not one to be forced upon, because you will face your judgment. So, Brandy, speak to us. <laughs> some girlfriend, some girlfriend you bring. Girlfriend? How what labels do you put on? How what labels do you put on? And yet, you find me to be empty as a well. Obviously, this person is important enough that you would destroy the fabric of the group. The fabric of the group is not of what I seek. For what I seek, I seek for unity in all. Her being is an all to complete the one. The four, the four forces. Can we not have that unity? Do we dare break our trio bonds? Do we yet face a movement of which we cannot find for ourselves? Sometimes you babble Is like it a it cannot brook. and be complete. And I question you, Evangeline. Are you the one who is the fearing of the movement? You speak of Philos, but yet you do not follow up Philos. Do you realize what you're thinking, what you're saying? Sometimes I think you don't think before you say, for one is foolish in his own steps. And yet, you sit there and wall in your own agony. Oh. Oh. Sometimes I wish you were just a football player. Back away, you spit spine. Okay, well, how about this? How about we... No. Let's go down to the beach. The beach? Let us... The beach is fine. Let us enjoy. Let us take. For I came not to quarrel, for I came to gaze at the stars, the lovely things that they are. Let us examine. Let us lay down and examine and find ourselves in what we are. Let's. Ah, uh, the stars. They're precious. They're brilliant. They mean so much to so many. The stars, arranged in their groups, happy. You don't see them inviting another star to betray. The stars, foreshadowed forever long to be stories put upon them and dreams forever woven between their links. The stars are um, really far away. True. True. The stars, dead, hollow gas, heating infinite galaxies of life. I could only think how Napoleon once lay on his back and looked at the same dead, hollow, burning spheres that I look at tonight and think beauty.
And yet the tree, just as the stars, so old in its, in its withering heights, and yet we try to understand the tree, for it has wisdom as well. Evangeline? Wisdom indeed. The tree is like the soul. It is always drawing its water. It is producing its fruit. We take you for granted, poor tree, dear tree, luscious tree. Oh, how you give us life. Oh, how you are life. I pity the tree. It's one pitiful, futile attempt at transcendence, limited by its earthly body, trapped forever in frozen death. Yeah, it's a bug. And yet we find ourselves to understand these many things of nature. What is our real motive here, people? Do we have something that we love and yet cherish? And yet are we yet defined to keep it within? Are you afraid? Or shall we seek it by entering? our amphitheater of hate and of love. What do you fear? Broken heart. Loneliness. Pain. What do you love? Only emptiness. Friendship. Pain. What do you envy? Trees. Rock star lifestyles. Pain. What do you devour? The only love for which I have held together for so long. Love in all forms. Pain. The sun is nearly up. Our night is drawing too close. We only have one more exercise left. Oh, I have to go, guys. Um, thanks for letting me come. It was, it was fun. Yeah. Good night, buddy. Good night, Joe. Good night, Eric. Good night. Hey, tomorrow night, night, instead of doing this, do you guys want to come over to my place and get a movie or play Trivial Pursuit or something? I guess. That could be intriguing. Okay, see you guys later. I'll call you. Good yeah. evening. Synopsis, what was that? She was at a philosopher came to me and she uses our school names. Let's get a movie. A movie. I cannot find what is in myself to accomplish my own needs. I have found that pleasing others has not been the way to go, because it is only within, and yet I shelter my love. Love, 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 fade in, fade out. And yet I trip on my own desires, and I see that you are correct in your ways. I am sorry. Thou art sorry. And I see the sun for a new day, and yet I ask for your forgiveness. Forgiveness is granted. I completely understand. Sometimes the projection we project upon others is so beautiful that we see not their true soul. Let's never fight again. Long live. Long live the philosopher kings. Long live and forever stay! <laughs> Closing poem. One has learned many ways, yet the ways are troublesome. The road is long and weary, with many exits, many entries. Yet we all learn our ways. We all learn our paths, and we try to keep them straight. My girl, she had fallen short of me, and yet another way learned, another way tread. Love, 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 fade in, fade out. Closing poem, a night of emotion, a night of excess, a night of lessons. Lessons quickly learned or lessons quickly forgotten. Hopefully we will learn.
closing poem. The pain, the fear, the anger, it all fades. We are strong. We are strong. We continue on. Trace. Trio. Play. Three. Three united, and it feels so good. Oh, to be a philosopher king. Closing poem. I hate art fags. But if you feel like I feel, I got the antidote. We've been waiting for any hope. Take the chorus and it goes. I'm Slim Shady, if I'm the real Shady. All you other Slim Shadies are just imitating. So won't the real Slim Shady please stand up? Please stand up. What do you fear? Hate. Emptiness. Rejection. What do you hate? Trash. Hate. <laughs> Art. Hold on. What do you fear? Kitty litter. Excess. Rejection. What do you taste? Love. Fear. <laughs> what makes you horny? <laughs> what do you fear? Money. Spiders. Potholes. What do you want? Money. Love. Crap. What do you smell? The only thing that I've ever hated. Death. <laughs> what do you hate? Trucks. Injustice. Traffic. What do you envy? Love. Joe. Money. <laughs> Joe? What's <laughs> up? <laughs> what do you love? Butnik oil supplies. <laughs> What do you fear? Chains. Justice. Rejection. What do you love? Only emptiness. Evangelion. <laughs> <laughs> what do you fear? Chains. Justice. 